Good evening guys, uh, today I'm fishing with Cliff, uh, actually up the cliffs. Uh, so we're going to go up the cliffs and have a fish, um, just see what's about. I'm um, looking forward to it. Uh, so without further ado, let's get down there, let's get set up and uh, let's crack on with the session. Right, so my first bait is actually this one here, uh, it's just a squid. Um, you got the circle at the bottom there, which I've bait elasticed up and making sure I put a lot of bait elastic on just underneath the um, eye of the hook and just above just to keep that nice and tight and then crisscross round um, the actual hook to keep that straight as well and um, then I've just nipped the top hook into the top of the bait there just to hold that all in one place while I cast it out um, I'm actually using some yellow grip threads today uh, just to hold on the, on the floor of the sea uh, on a pulley rig, sorry on a panel rig um, just nice clip down panel rig, just going to flip that out uh, nice and short and then hopefully we'll be able to pick up our target fish tonight which is actually bass uh, so let's crack on. I'm going to show you bait up again then. So we've got, the, we've got a squid here. It's a nice frozen squid. Um, we've got a rig here. So you're going to find the end of it. There. Panel rig. We've got a large circle hook on the bottom. A smaller one on the top. Just going to get our circle hook. Through the bottom of the squid. Like so. That will sit about there. Get our bait elastic. And just wrap that round. When I wrap it around, I make sure I go all the way up the line, all the way to the top of the um, of the squid, and that holds everything nice and tight, and the, the line nice and tight, and everything streamlined down the actual bait. So. Weather's really against us today. It is windy and it is rainy, which is not the best. But you know, no pain, no gain. What I'm doing is I'm just pinching the squid up round the hook, so it disguises the actual hook. But I'm keeping the point nice and exposed. That's where the fish bites down on, and that's where I want the fish to bite. Nice and tight in there. Yeah, it's good. That's tight. So that's, that's, that's the bottom hook there. A little bit disguised by the squid at the bottom. Just gonna get my top, top hook. That's gonna come down. Go around a couple of times. So it's nice and tight. And we're gonna put that into the top of the bait. Like so, pull in that a little bit, and that's your squid bait there. Right on guys, so I've just missed uh, two massive bites. Um, bought the bait in, and the bait's been like taken, but from the wrong end. Uh, so <laughs> so uh, the whole of the size missing of the bait. So what I'm doing now is I'm going to switch the hooks around. I'm going to have one facing that way, one facing that way, reversed, um, and see if that makes a difference. Um, but yeah, it's a good sign that the fish are about. Cliff's getting some rattles as well. Uh, so yeah, uh, let's see if the evening progresses. Um, we're just using one rod, um, one squid bait, and just focusing all my attention on that one rod uh, to hopefully gain my target tonight. Do you want to hold him up? Oh, you can hold him up. Right, so I'm here with Cliff, and Cliff has just reeled into the first fish of the night, uh, which is a nice dogfish. Beautiful dogfish, 58. First fish of the night, lovely. Happy days. Happy days. Let them go back now. Let's get, let's get them back and uh, we'll carry on the session. Right, so the weather's absolutely atrocious, but we're getting some fantastic bites. I mean, uh, look at that. I should really be pulling it in, but I just want to show you guys how good the bites are here. Absolutely awesome. Really, really nice, clear bites. Really strong. Hopefully we'll be able to land the fish. I've, I've, I've reeled in a couple of times and I just can't land the fish. Can't seem to be landing the fish. But yeah, I'm going to put the camera down now and I'm going to reel that in and hopefully I'll be able to pull my first fish of the night in. Right on guys, just a quick update from me. Cliff is still beating me. 1-0 at the moment on the dogfish. I've had two crack offs, lost complete sets of gear and I've also broken a reel. So happy days. I'm on a spare reel now. Uh, so hopefully the spare reel will bring me some luck. 
Right guys, so I reeled into my first fish of the evening, which is a nice dogfish. Nice little one there, not, a big as, not as big as this one, but I will take it as a fish. Not the target species, but you know, happy days. We'll carry on fishing and see if we can get that. Push just reeled into this nice... Yeah, bloody hell, fire. <laughs> take my bloody eyes out. <laughs> it's conga time. It's conga time with us. So a nice eel there, we're just going to try and measure him up. He is slipping and sliding everywhere. A wriggly old thing. Yeah, yes. Oh bloody hell. Use the tail. <laughs> <laughs> so we are... You pull the tail. It's about 70... 78, 80. Yeah. 80, 82, 80. That's a good 80. Yeah, it's definitely 80. Yeah. So let's get him back in. Yep, fantastic. One. And he's going back in. Slime. Proper, proper chunky. He is proper chunky, isn't he? And nice see fit. where the back dorsal fin is. Yeah, on the top. Nearer the head. Nice one. Awesome. He's going back in. Go. Away he goes. We are. Got a little bass. Target, Target species. species. Woohoo! Here we go. We're in for a good one. About 35 ish. Yeah, that's no, nice. Nice Look, one. Lovely man. fish. They're out there. We're so going to catch them. We've got two dogfish, an eel. A bass and a ton of missed bites. Yes, loads of bites. <laughs> and a broken reel. It's all good. And some lost rigs. <laughs> so yeah, everything's happening tonight. So we're just going to carry on. And I'm going to try and catch another fish. Right, it's the second fish of the evening for me. Uh, another nice little dogfish. Uh, that was caught on the, uh, on the squid and lug wrap again. So yeah, uh, nothing of a big size. But, uh, you know, still another fish. So we're doing alright. That's pretty cool. So two dogfish in a bag. Uh, fish had a variety of different species tonight, so um, I'm looking forward to hopefully getting something different. Right, so at the moment what I'm doing is I'm just making some of these lug sausages. Uh, I've been using quite a lot of squid mixed with uh, lug, just in like a little uh, cocktail bait. And now we've made some squid, uh, now I've made some just pure uh, salted and old lug uh, sausages, just a circle at the bottom there, and that's the plan. Uh, let's see if we can try and pull some more fish in. But yeah, no, it's been a good evening so far. I had a good laugh with Cliff. I pulled in a couple of fish, so I mean, what's not to like? What's not to like? It's definitely good fun. Uh, enjoying fishing, you know, these new different places. And uh, just getting out there and giving it a go. Right, and so we're into Big Eel number two, I think. Is it number two or number three? Uh, number two. Number two, just going to measure him up. Trying to keep him nice and still. Away from the gear. Away from all the gear. That is chunky. Look at that. Well, I'll keep his head still. That looked looked like an 88 or yeah. maybe a 90. Yeah, I reckon that's about a 90. Yeah, it's definitely a 90. <laughs> yeah, we're at 90. We're at 90 on that one. 90 centimetre eel. Happy days, mate. Awesome. Let's get some pictures and we'll put them back in. Here we go. Another reel for Cliff. Another reel. You got 92, did we say? 92. 92. I think it was 92. Be beautiful conga. Wow, what a session that was. That was a good session. Um, really good session. Uh, for me, um, I had two crack offs, <laughs> broke a reel, and uh, caught two dogfish, which was a uh, you know standard evening. Um, glad I didn't blank. So that was a, that was a bonus. Uh, Cliff, on the other hand, wow, what a session he had. Two conga reels, um, a bass. And some other bits and pieces. So yeah, it was a, it was a, it was a good evening. It was it was good fun. The company was good. Uh, you know what, what more could you want down the cliffs? Uh, it's a bit eerie down there at night. I wouldn't want to go down there on my own. <laughs> but yeah, no, it was another good night. So thanks for watching, guys, uh, and I'll see you soon. Cheers.